Hello everybody, it's Uncle Matt and I'm here to read you another bedtime story. And tonight's bedtime story is called Just My Best Friend by Mercer Mayer. And this book was copyright in 2019. You ready? Here we go. My best friend, Tiger, is coming over for a camp out in my tree house. I get everything just right. Mum helps. I am waiting. It is getting late. I am still waiting. Little critter, Mum calls. Tiger is sick and can't come over tonight. Hmm. I am upset. I am mad. I climb out of the treehouse. I stomp across the yard. I stomp through the house. I go to my room. I look at a comic book, but I am too upset to read. My little sister wants to play cards. I shut my door. My little sister cries. Mum scolds me. I hug her and say, I'm sorry. I go outside. I play with my toy figures, but they are no fun. Then I throw my ball, but my aim is bad. Oops, I hit a window. I ride my bike, but there is nowhere to go. I jump on the trampoline, but trampolines are boring. I want to walk my dog, but he just wants to sleep. Dad comes home, he asks, want to play catch? No, I say. Help me with the groceries, Dad says. I help, but I drop the eggs. Dinner is ready, Mom calls, but I don't want any dinner. Mom says, sit down and eat. You can't always do what you plan. I say, that's not fair. I'm staying in my treehouse. I don't need a best friend. I play games by myself. I eat tons of snakes and chips. Okay, I drink all the juice by myself. It is getting dark. Oh no, I ate too much. I am getting sick. It is getting scary. I go inside, my tummy hurts. I call mom. Mom gives me some yucky medicine and puts me in bed. The phone rings, Tiger says, I'm sorry you are sick. I say, I'm sorry you are sick too. You are still my best friend. Well, sometimes we can have things that happen to us that we don't expect to happen. You know, bad things, people getting sick. I'm glad that this little critter here, you know, finally talked to Tiger and they were able to patch things up. Yes, yeah, sometimes things go unexpected. And that's all the time we have for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. I hope you enjoyed that story. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.